Nowhere near a conspiracy freak or anything like that, but I do admit I get a hard on for any documentary on that secret military base in Nevada that is called Area 51. The government is supposed, well, I mean, believing in aliens, like, I, I, I don't know, that, that's really not that crazy. You know, you, you think, like, how big the fucking universe is? There's just life on one planet. No life anywhere else, despite the fact that they see evidence of water on Mars at some point. You know, I'm telling you guys, we're not that special. If you're God and you made the whole universe, are you just going to sit back watching one fucking planet? Maybe that's why the Earth is so fucked up. I don't think he's been watching us for the last couple thousand. When was the last time he reached out? Reach out, reach out, and freak someone out. Right? When was the last time he fucking did that? When was the last time he fucking was in a burning bush going, hey, hey, you there, you there with the long fucking curvy stick next to the sheep. Come over here. Come over to the burning bush. You know, when was the last time he did that? I think he's been watching other Earths. Um, flipping through the channels. You know? Can you imagine how clear his fucking... How big do you think God's flat screen TV is? How clear... Is that picture? I bet even if you make it to heaven, you know, you don't even get to see it. Like he comes out of his office and you try to peek in real quick, and like the human eye, you get, it just it's just too much of a fucking glare, right? Um. So, anyways, yeah, if you believe in aliens, I mean, I mean, I don't know that 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 we can reach one another. You know that whole flying saucer fucking horseshit. I mean, how long can you go with with artificial breathe, you know, some sort of atmosphere in there? That was like on Star Trek. I mean, they just had this limitless supply of fucking oxygen. Just fucking flying through space. They Now, look at them. They landed on a lot of planets that had oxygen. They would just land on these planets and they just had oxygen. I think what they did was they opened the – they landed – the Starship Enterprise, and they just opened the windows, and they got some more oxygen, and then they, they flew away, right? Isn't that how it works? <clears throat> Anyways. Um, the government supposedly is housing and researching crashed UFOs and uses deadly force to keep regular people out. Do you have any opinion on the subject? I think I just said this. I mean, I don't fuck. Do I think they actually have the bodies of aliens? Um... Do you, do you realize, like, the level of secrecy you would have to have if you actually had that shit? That would be, like, one of the things before they went in the room. It's like, okay, we're going to let you in this room. And you got to understand, when you go in this room, the door is closing and you're never getting out. Because you're going to see some fucking shit in here that I don't give a fuck. You're not, if you have one shot of NyQuil, you're, you're going to be blabbering about it. You, you can't do it. So I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't fucking know. Um, Anyways, he goes, what does your bullshit meter say? I think there's way too much of a veil of secrecy around the place to think otherwise. I used to know someone who was a career Air Force pilot. Whenever the subject of that base or those mysterious flights, mysterious lights over Phoenix seen in 1997 came up, he completely removed himself from the conversation. Uh, Those mysterious lights, I don't even know what you're talking about. For all you know, they're just testing some psycho fucking weaponry you know remember when the new yankee stadium came out in like 08 or 09 and they were like we have 2013 technology all right if those fucking morons that run that place can have shit that we're not gonna have you know they can be four or five years ahead of us can you imagine what the government is i mean they, they gotta have shit from like i don't know 2014 i, I have no fucking idea I don't know. Anyways, he says, uh, quite frankly, the evening's laughs would end right after the topic was brought up. I believe in life outside of our universe. To think that we human and all of Earth's inhabitants are the only life anywhere is just plain ignorant. I 100% agree with that. Uh, I'm sure you've heard stories about President Nixon secretly showing UFOs and aliens to his favorite comedian, Jackie Gleason. Uh, That's a complete crock of shit. Uh, What would you (laughs) like? He's going to do that. All right. Now, I know I'm not supposed to show you this. I know I'm not supposed to show you this. And away we go. That was a bad Nixon impression right there. 
Um, what would happen if you were shown some stuff like that? I imagine I would immediately be microchipped or shot in the back of the fucking head. Would you tell about it? I wouldn't want to know about that. That If I actually found out about that, it would blow my fucking mind. I, you know what it is? Look, maybe the, maybe your Air Force guy buddy there has seen something because I would say that like all convers no, but you know what? He laughs right up until that moment. If he wasn't laughing at all throughout all your conversation, then I would I would believe it more because I know if I knew some shit like that, and then I would sit there and listening to people talking about God and holy shit that we believe down here that didn't include aliens, I would I would feel like a fucking alien. Because I would be like, uh, yeah, we're just a speck of dust there, people. And there's all this other stuff out there. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it would drive me nuts after a while. Um, yeah, no, I'm not cut out for that fucking uh, – the kind of secrets I can keep are like, uh, you know, you know, it stays in the locker room kind of shit. You know what I mean? You live your life how you want to fucking live your life. You know, and until like if you're uh, look, if you're pouring shit into the water supply, you know, if you're doing stuff like that, if you're fucking vandalizing the neighborhood I live in, then go fuck yourself. All right. But, you know, the other bullshit, I look the other way. But if, if I knew there was fucking aliens. Yeah, no, there's look, I'm too fucking stupid. There's no way they would tell it to me. If I was in the Air Force, how far into the Air Force do you think I would get? Do you think I'd get anywhere beyond the guy with the two sticks guiding the fucking plane in?